from Pearl Tea. Hello, I'm Uncle Sam, reporting to you live from the campaign office, which is in a secret location known only to myself. And now, unfortunately, my wife never leaves me alone, always telling me what to do. Anyway, we gave it a go and it didn't work. Muslims, non-Muslims just cannot live together in peace. Just doesn't work. Anyway, I have a solution and I call it Islamania. Nobody has fought harder to kick the Muslims out of Australia than the great people of Cronulla. So I'm here to get these people behind me in my quest to establish Islamania. As you can see, we will move all of the Muslims to Tasmania, yeah. all of the non-Muslims to the mainland, and we will call Tasmania Islamania. You like that? Uh, well, they have to have some choice themselves. We yes. can't push people around, you know. You can't just tell them that they're moving. The great John Howard introduced the GST. The great John Howard. That's Point right. There. I want to be like the new John Howard. Oh, well. I will do what nobody likes to do We've because had... I'm leader. And they're all Australian. No, all Australian. But a uh, Muslim it's Australian. It's garbage about Muslims. They're all Australian. Like the Italians. Good luck. I'm a bit confused uh, as to what she just said, but something about Italian Muslims being Australians. Will you be happy to house some of the displaced Tasmanian refugees in your house? Absolutely. I'm currently trying to organize the transportation. I'm here with the great Tony Cable. Now, Tony, what I want to do is I want to transfer all of the Tasmanian residents to the mainland and all of the Muslims to Tasmania. Yes. But uh, there is 500,000 Muslims on the mainland we need to move. But how do you want to transport uh, them? We want to use your boat. Okay, 25 at a time. Uh, it takes them about six day return trip. 500,000 divided by six. So this will be completed in about three years. This is like the Islamic first fleet and you will be the Captain Cook. Uh, but you can't kill any Aborigines. No, uh, uh, no. You will be the uh, uh, captain of my I'll shipping be, uh, services. The captain. The captain. minister for shipping services. Yeah. Okay, it's great to be here. Uh, we are very, I'm very excited to have here with me uh, two of Australia's greatest stars from the blockbuster hit show, The Shire. Uh, uh, Sophie, Hi. Sophie Hello. and uh, Vanessa. Hello. Very excited to be here. They are going to be the face of the new uh, Tasmania campaign. So um, this is, uh, we need to really sell it. We want to get all of the Muslims to move to Tasmania. Do you think my boobs are too out there for the Muslims to be moving? Uh, yes, a little bit. Okay, so just loud and clear. I don't get that word, Sharia. Sharia. Sharia law is the only law. Both blow a kiss. <laughs> <laughs> I think what she meant to do was... Good girls. Wait, I need to fix my boobs. Me too. Um, maybe you want to turn around when you do this thing? Probably not. Australia, the laws aren't from Tasmania well, here yet. When we're in Islamania, you cannot do these things. Okay. But how about this time? You really try to give it. You really try to, like... Should I wrap it out? Try to do the... Yo, yo, yeah. yo. Okay, three, two, one. Come on, girls. Hi, I'm Sophie. And I'm Vanessa. And we're, we're from, from the Shire. And we just love Islamania. Tasmania was good before, but now... It's totes Muslim. It's even better. Shira law is the only law. That's right, so. And remember, if you're heading to Islamania, cover up. Respect all cultures. Show us your mask. <laughs> Vote for Uncle Sam! And make Australia halal. Yeah, I think we have it. I think we have it. Uh, the, uh, the great girls from the Shire. Uh, we'll be able to convince the masses of Australia to, to move. They say that uh, sells, so they have definitely sold something today.